Hi, this is Jay. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how you can use Excel VBA to send an email via Outlook now to your recipient. So up here, I have <clears throat> different tabs or different worksheets. And in this case, I want to be able to write a macro you know, or routine, if you want to say, to, to, send, to send this YTD budget summary worksheet uh, to, to myself. And to do that, let's open the VBA window. So you'll be going to developer and then click on Visual Basic. And we're going to insert a new module. <clears throat> and we're going to call this macro email summary. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to declare our variables. And my variable will be uh, email, email recipient. Yes. So, you know, it's going to be pro, but in this case, I'm going to just email to myself. <clears throat> and I should I mean, do this. So, I'm going to use the input box so that it will prompt you to you know, enter, enter the recipient's email address. And the first thing you want to do is you want to copy a particular worksheet that you want to uh, send the email to. So in this case, I want to take uh, worksheets YTD budget summary. And it's going to make a copy. And from that point, it's going to create a new Excel workbook. And so you will see in a second. So I take workbook. Use the same mail number and recipients it will be S. It should be oh, I made a mistake, so it should be string and it should be places S email underscore recipients. And I'll take, the, take this variable and copy paste over and the next thing will be to do is your subject. So your your your, uh, your email subject. So uh, email summary to myself. It will be my email subject. Okay. And that's pretty much it. So the next thing we're going to do is going to close the active workbook. And do we want to close and do we want to see? Save change, going to set to false. Oops, save change. Hmm. Let me take a look. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, it seems like there's no typo or anything. So let's go ahead and try it. So, and so let's go to view and click on macros. I'm going to only use the macro in this workbook. So I only have one email summary and click on run. Okay, and it's going to prompt you to enter the, the recipient's email address. So in this case, my email address is jj YouTube channel at outlook.com. And click on OK. So you're going to see this warning message saying, uh, from Outlook. It's saying that, you no, know, do you want to allow uh, Excel to open applications or Outlook you know, software? So I'm going to select allow. Okay. Now, if I go back to my <clears throat> uh, email inbox, and I should be receiving you know, the Excel attachment, uh, surely. Um, and let's wait. <clears throat> email to email something to myself that was the subject and 
if you open this Excel file, you will see that this Excel file only contains one worksheet, which is you know, the worksheet that we simplify you know, from our Excel VBA. I hope you guys found this video useful and feel free to email me any question you have. And talk to you guys later. Bye bye. If you found my video useful, please give me a like to my video and subscribe to my channel. And I look forward to posting more videos in the future. Thank you and bye bye.